Hi everyone. I hope you're safe and you're healthy. Um, I hope you've been practicing these breathing and these meditation techniques whenever you needed them or just for fun. Um, today, we're going to be talking about imagination. Albert Einstein, um, who some of you know, was a famous scientist who actually said that imagination is more important than knowledge. Imagination is more important than knowledge. So that is very, very important. Our imagination is always at work, whether we know it or not. Um, so, for example, sometimes when we're worried about something, our imagination is thinking about things that could go wrong or some of the bad things that might happen. So whether we know it or not, our imagination is always working. But we can also use our imagination to think about the best possible thing. The, like whatever you're thinking of, whatever you're struggling with, think about the best possible thing that can happen. And you using your imagination can help that best possible thing happen more. So the more we practice using our imagination, the more it'll actually help us. Um, and we do a lot of exercises about the love and light in your heart. It's because the more we believe in the love inside of us, the more we believe in the light inside of us, the more it'll help us do whatever we want to do. So today we're going to practice using our um, imagination with the love and light in our hearts. So I want you to go ahead and close your eyes and take your hands and put them over your heart. Take a deep breath in and out. Feel your hands and your heart getting warmer. Take a deep breath in and out. Feel all that love and light in your heart. Take a deep breath in. And out. Now let your hands fall down to the side or fall onto your lap. Keep your eyes closed. Take a deep breath in. Your heart is full of love and light and your body is full of love and light. Now imagine the best possible thing that something um, about something you're having a hard time with. Whatever it is you're struggling with, think about the best possible thing that can happen with whatever you're struggling with. Maybe you're not getting along with someone at home, someone, uh, your sister, your brother, your family your aunt, uncle, somebody. Maybe you're struggling with getting along with someone in your home. Or maybe you're struggling with shooting a basketball into the hoop. Maybe you're just not able to shoot it into the hoop just right. Think about whatever it is that you're struggling with. Now take a deep breath in. And breathe out. Now imagine yourself making that basketball into the hoop. Imagine yourself making one shot into the hoop, making two shots into the hoop, making three shots. How does that feel? Imagine how that feels to make all of those shots into the hoop. Now, if you're struggling with getting along with someone, imagine that you're laughing with them at a joke, or you're playing with them, or you're talking to them, or you're talking with them. Imagine yourself getting along with them, whoever it is. What does that look like? And what does that feel like? Use your imagination to think about the best possible thing that can happen with whatever you're struggling with. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. 
Think about the best possible thing that can happen with whatever you're struggling with. Take another last deep breath in. And out. And go ahead and open your eyes. So remember that our imagination is always working, whether we know it or not. But the more we use our imagination with the love and light in our hearts, the more we can do whatever we want to do. I used my imagination today to think of ways to help you um, to make this video. And I hope that it did help you. I hope that you'll continue to use your imagination with whatever you're struggling with. I know I'll continue to use in my imagination with whatever I'm struggling with. Um, so I hope that it helped. And I'm going to continue thinking about the best possible things of whatever I'm having a hard time with. I hope you do too. So take care of yourself, stay safe, and that's all. Till next time.